So whether you're using a tool once or running a complex analytical model, spatial analysis really brings more value to GIS and your entire agency. As GIS professionals, you want to look for opportunities to remind people about spatial analysis and help people make better decisions. And you want to continue to sharpen your own spatial analysis skills so that you continue to have high value to your organization. Exactly. And if you're wondering where a good place to start is, I'd recommend Esri Press. And the reason why is we make a lot of great books that describe in very detailed directions how to do some of the spatial analysis I've shown you. I would also recommend looking at Esri Training because we have instructors that lead classes, but we also have online training and it's self-paced so that you can sit at your own desk and take these classes as well. You can also take instructor-led training sitting at your desk. That's so right. So you don't need to go to an authorized location. You can actually take a class with an instructor through your computer and, and web mm -hmm. technologies. Yep. So we've now reached the end of our seminar today, and I hope you've all enjoyed what you've seen and have sharpened your skills. I know you've learned now that GIS is becoming web GIS, and that doesn't mean the work that you're doing today isn't valuable and that the work you're doing on desktop and server is going away. In fact, it's more important. Using WebGIS extends that information out and makes it available to even more people. Mm -hmm. And we learned a bit in the beginning about curators of content. As GIS professionals, it's your responsibility to not only manage your own content, but understand how you can integrate other people's contents and serve it up in an appropriate manner to those, manner to those who need it. And we looked at configurable resources. These are fantastic ways for you to quickly get applications up and running, easy to use focused applications that the public can use and internal staff can use. Mm -hmm. And last but not least, our favorite part was spatial analysis. We showed you how you can use some of the common core tools to do great analysis, and we showed some examples of some of the more advanced tools and how they can be used. And I want to take a moment to point out that as GI pro GIS professionals, this is a core part of what we do. This is really the thing that can make us the most valuable to the entire organization. So on behalf of myself and Harry and all of our Esri colleagues here today, we'd like to thank you very much for coming today.